So, good performance today. Plenty of chances created, but an absolute sucker punch at the end. And it's uh, Waltham Abbey that leave. We, unfortunately, with the points, uh, give us your thoughts, please. Very difficult route, so I very difficult with that because uh, the lads have given us everything today. They, they've lifted it all out on the pitch. Um, a real tight game, good game, real good game. You know, it was both teams cancelled each other out. We've had chances, they've had chances, and at the end, it's look, it's just a, every goal's got mistakes in it. But at the end, a couple of just just made mistakes at the wrong time, and ninety fifth minute's gone in. You know. We go on record here now, and I, I say, look, we've not had it all year. Our time will come when we get our last minute winner. You know, it can't, it can't keep going the other way. And if it comes in a like another really important game, and we get our last minute winner, it'll happen because you know there's, there's lots of negatives around what you can say. But the boys weren't today. They they gave it all. They played like a good side, um, and that that was a that was a draw of a game that just just went out of our way at the end and it's just that's football sometimes but on a personal level with a boy I, I ain't the performance I'm not too disappointed they they gave a thing and they played from in my eyes I thought they played well so just a sucker punch and a killer and that's that's football yeah touching on what you said there can you give us an idea of what you said to the boys after that they need to continue to believe don't they we're still still so much to play for uh, in this exciting and tense end of the season <laughs> you can say what you like it's a 95th minute winner against you um, it's a tough one to take isn't it so there's no magic words going to do it no magic formula is going to get you out of it we just got to group together look another big game on Monday which is what we're set for you know the only disappointment is we had to make another two subs through injuries you know that's why we couldn't pick maybe Carl today and both Carl and, and Kyle today because it's injury prevention Emery and Alex has come off we've got to see how they are but look it's that stage of the season which is why we need the squad but um, yeah you go back and reflect on it and you go if buts and, maybe, if buts and maybes with it and it's, we've just fell short of that last little bit but as a performance, all right, we're going to be disappointed with a nil-nil probably, but to lose one nil, yeah, it's sick enough, you know, and I don't think it's a very good goal we conceded. If it's a good goal, you accept it, but I don't think that's a very good goal, so, yep, we can't do a lot about it now, mate, we move on to Monday. Yeah, like you said, a quick turnaround now, Biggleswood Town visiting on Monday, they're yep. obviously in fine form, but with a win there, things start to look different all look, of a sudden again, don't they? Look, we're, we're playing, we we seem to be playing teams <laughs> in form at the moment, we're, we're not, um, I don't think there's any pressure on pressure on us at all, Monday now. You know, I think that's it. You know, we are catch up, we're miles behind, on, and really, I don't. I think we go there and just give our all like, that we can do, Monday. We, we pressure's not on us, so we we just got to go there and just put a performance in, and we got to see who's first of all. We got to see who's available tomorrow. Um, but yeah, I'm looking forward to the game. It's a good games. What we're all here for games like that. Um, they've probably got the advantage because they've had a, a, a rest day today. So they're nice and fresh for it, but the stage of the season, mate, the game's come thick and fast and we just got to get enough bodies fit on the pitch for, for Monday, which we will do. Cheers, Lee. Cheers, sir.